Hello everyone, myself Bharadwaj. In the previous videos, we discussed how to calculate 4 to 20 milliamp signal from percentage. Similarly, we can calculate percentage from 4 to 20 milliamp signal. We discussed the formula and method for these calculations. We already discussed how to calculate percentage from the process variable, right? In this video, we will discuss how to calculate the process variable PV when we have the percentage. If we have a transmitter and the output is available in the form of percentage, 0 to 100 percentage, then how to calculate the process variable, okay? So, first see what is the formula. This formula is process variable is equal to PV is equal to X divided by 100 multiplied by tan plus LRV lower range value. So, here X is the percentage signal. Okay, percentage. Say for example, we have a transmitter, flow transmitter and the output is available in the form of percentage. Say my output is at 20 percentage, 30 percentage, some 60.5 percentage like that. You want to calculate the output in terms of process variable, right? Then this formula will be useful. Okay. So, before going into the example for problem, we have to know about this PV, span and LRV, lower range value. What are these? The PV is nothing but it is a process variable or physical quantity which we are going to measure. For example, if you are using a pressure transmitter, you are going to measure the pressure, right? So here the process variable is pressure. Well, similarly, for flow transmitter, the process variable is flow. Level transmitter, the process variable is level. Okay. So span. What is this span? Every transmitter, okay, any transmitter, say on FT, if you take an example FT, flow transmitter, every transmitter need to be configured for a certain range. Okay. Say my range is 0 to 200 meter cube per hour. Okay. This 0 will call it as LRV, lower range value, and this 200 will call it as URV, upper range value. Okay. Span is nothing but this URV minus LRV. In this example, it is 200 minus 0, that is equal to 200. My span is 200. My LRV, lower range value is 0. Upper range value is 200. Okay. Now, we will take one example problem and then we will discuss this formula. Okay. In my example problem, I will take one TT, temperature transmitter. Okay. And I will assume the range is range 0 to 300 degrees centigrade. Okay. I want to calculate when my output, okay, output percentage 25, 60, 85. That means when my temperature transmitter is output is 25 percentage, what is my PV process variable? Similarly, when my temperature transmitter output is 60 percentage, what is my PV? When my temperature transmitter output is 85, 85 percent is, what is my PV? Okay. PV means units is degree centigrade, right? So, I will use the formula and we will calculate for these three cases. 25 percent is, 60 percent is, 85 percent is. Okay. So, the first case, when my transmitter output is 25 percent is. What is the PV? 
process variable in degree centigrade right so pv is equal to what is the formula x divided by 100 x means percentage here the percentage is 25 so 25 divided by 100 multiplied by span here what is the span span is equal to upper range value minus lower range value upper range value is 300 lower range value is 0 so 300 minus 0 that is equal to how much 300 so this is my span so span is 300 so multiply by 300 plus LRV what is the LRV LRV is equal to 0 right this is my LRV 0 so 25 multiplied by 300 it is 7500 divided by 100 so that is equal to how much 75 degree centigrade so when my transmitter output is 25 percent the output pv is 75 degree centigrade okay next we will see the next case when my output is at 60 percentage okay what is the pv so the problem so formula is pv is equal to process variable is equal to x divided by 100 x means 60 60 divided by 100 multiplied by span is 300 plus lrv it is 0 that is equal to 60 multiplied by 300 it is 18000 18, 1 2 3 divided by 100 right that is equal to how much 180 units degree centigrade so when my transmitter output is 60 percentage the pv is equivalent to 180 degree centigrade similarly take the third case it is 85 percentage so when my output is 85 percentage what is the equivalent pv so pv is equal to same formula right 85 divided by 100 multiplied by span 300 plus lrv it is 0 so 85 multiplied by 300 it is 25500 divided by 100 that is equal to how much 255 degree centigrade so this is my pv when my transmitter output is 85 percentage which is the equivalent clear now we solved all the three cases now i will take one more example say i have a transmitter ft flow transmitter and its range is 0 to 1500 meter cube per hour okay if my transmitter output is 30.5 percentage this is the output then what is the pv okay so what we have to need so we need span right span it is urv minus lrv 1500 minus 0 right so it is 1500 what is my lrv here again 0 so we have to apply the formula right pv is equal to x divided by 100 x means percentage here it is 30.5 so 30.5 divided by 100 multiplied by span span is 1500 right so 1500 plus lrv it is 0 so that is equal to 30.5 multiplied by 1500 it is 45 750 divided by 100 okay so that is equal to how much 457.5 meter cube per hour so this is the output so a 
and my output is 30.5 percentage and this is the pv okay so by using this formula you can calculate the process variable from the percentage signal okay so next i will give you two basic problems apply this formula calculate it and share the answers with us through the comment section okay so my first problem to you okay assume there is a pt for the transmitter and its range is minus 1 to 10 bar okay and this present transmitter output is 44.7 percentage okay and my output is 44.7 percentage what is the equivalent pv process variable in bar apply this formula solve it and share your answer okay next second problem problem 2 there is a flow transmitter ft and it is configured range is 0 to 480 meter cube per hour okay so this ft output is 64.71 percentage so what is the process variable value okay apply this formula solve these two problems and share your answers with us through the comment section do like this video share this video and subscribe to the channel thank you for your support